Thank you, Steve. New body camera video here revealing the moments after a deputy chase and crash that killed a person and seriously hurt another. And that was the suspect, Joshua Soule, asking if he had hit someone. And that has been a big part of this case because some witnesses and family members claimed it was the deputy who hit those men. Gaston County Bureau reporter Ken Lemon has been working for weeks to get a hold of this video. And Ken, the suspect's own words seem to side with the deputies in all this. Yeah, you, you, you tend to hear a little bit of grief, a little bit of remorse in the voice of that suspect from that chase. That started about five blocks down Rankin uh, Avenue here. Uh, the two victims, well, they were hit just about a block away, right in this area there. But you don't see that pursuit video. As a matter of fact, the video doesn't pick up until afterwards, after uh, that pursuit ends uh, in an area right about there. That suspect, Joshua Soul, first claimed he wasn't intentionally running from deputies. You can see officers pull a plastic bag out of his pocket. Then he became despondent. Oh my God, is that Did I hit somebody? Did I hit somebody? No, you didn't hit anybody. Not that we know of. But that was really stupid. Soul isn't convinced. Seconds later, he's crying and appears to be praying. God, please don't let nobody be hurt. Please don't let nobody be hurt, Lord. Did you hit somebody? I don't know. I think so. Soul turned to the officer, asking him to take his life. Two men were hit by that car down the street, and Trail Garnigan was killed. Sean Smith critically wounded. Soul's own words, believing he hit someone, seems to contradict Smith's family, who all along have insisted it was the deputy who actually hit both men. We need EMS. Another deputy's body so, camera recorded their reaction at the crash scene. So, EMS on the way. We didn't hit him. This video is edited so we don't show the two victims lying on the ground. You can clearly hear angry and frustrated family members in the background. Now, I talked with one of those family members who told me that he was disappointed that video doesn't show the pursuit in this case. Everyone here still insists that they saw the deputy hit those two individuals, not Joshua Soul, Erica. So, Ken, why don't they have the dash camera video of that pursuit? Well, in Gaston County, Erica, the Gaston County Sheriff's Department doesn't do regular patrol, road patrol. Uh, that's up to Gaston County Police and Gastonia Police in this case. So they typically don't need those dash camera videos. So we looked at that video from today, that body camera video that they do have, and that shows us a little bit about what the individual, what that deputy in that pursuit says right after that crash. You'll hear that at 6 o'clock, Erica. All right, Kim, we'll look forward to your next report.